Welcome to my channel Swiftland. This tutorial I will show you how to, to export GitView to Excel in SP.NET using VB. If you don't subscribe my channel yet, please subscribe and press the bell icon for upcoming videos. This is my server catalog SBR. Go to Observe Explorer, explore my task DB. This is uh, my database and table. Table is student info underscore tab. And these are the records, uh, student ID, name, addresses, contact, and date of birth. You can see. Okay, now I'm gonna create an sv.net web form site to create file new website. Okay, now click on Visual Basic in the left fan and click on sp.net web form site okay now select the location where you want to create this uh, website uh, my location is bb.net project tutorial select and that backslash uh, now just write a uh, name what's the name export git to excel okay uh, this is the default uh, div and content just to remove this content and uh, now this is blank page in this place, um, uh, I will show how to export grid view in Excel using bb.net. Okay, the student info center. Yes, now go to the toolbox and uh, add a grid view control. Yes, it has this grid view. Okay. Now go to the uh, form load event and in this form load I write code to load data in grid view using bb.net so dimcon as new SQL connection uh, SQL connection is to get uh, to use this SQL connection you should add name space input system to data dot SQL client okay now add connection in the server explorer server name is catalog hyphen sbr authentication SQL server authentication username as and password is SQL server authentication password select the database my database name is my task db test connection succeeded okay click on okay yes it's connected with the uh, asp.net website okay now right click on the database my task db click on property and double click to copy the connection string and paste it in the double quotation uh, square connection you can see is already a size okay but password is uh, like a star so you should put your original password okay now command dim com command dim com as new SQL command my SQL command is to select all the records from the SQL Server database table to grid view so my table name is student info underscore tab select the start from student info underscore tab and initialize the connection string con okay now dim as da as data as new SQL data adapter this is the command com okay now dim dt as new data table okay to use the data value you should add name space import system the data okay it's added now finally as data dot fill dd okay now grid view grid view my grid view name is grid view one dot data source equal to dt grid view one dot data bind okay now right click and view in browser yes so that these are the records uh, in uh, what's the records in the SQL Server database table and it's displaying in the grid view okay now I'm gonna add a button this button control I'll use to export grid view to Excel using bb.net okay text is export to Excel okay now for color is white and uh, font size font bold true and font size is large okay now change the back color of this button back color is yes select this color yes it's looking nice 
now this is a button on click event in this uh, event I'll write code to export the uh, grid view to Excel so first of all response dot clear clear content okay now response dot add header content hyphen disposition and value is this is name content have disposition is name and value is attachment okay attachment file name uh, after exporting this uh, excel file it will uh, ex export uh, as student file dot xls okay now response dot content type equal to application bnd dot ms excel okay now dim sw writer this is for string writer sw writer as new string writer okay to use string writer you should add namespace import system dot io yes the namespace is added import system dot io dim html to writer as new html text writer as w writer called as as w writer now grid view one grid view one is my grid view control uh, in spx form name is grid view one grid view one dot render control html t writer what i declared for html text writer finally response dot write as w writer dot twisting okay then response dot int okay, it's done now right click and view in browser click on export text oh content when content review must be placed inside the form tag of the run equal to server will be must place in uh, yes yes uh, to solve this error you should uh, add two line of codes this is public overloads over it sub verify this is to verify that this is HTML uh, verify in server form used to verify that the control is rendered and an estimate okay by bell c s control okay verify rendering in server form okay reload this page and click on export uh, yes now save yes it's downloaded now open this file and folder and open this file yes click on yes yes see that the records uh, what is in the uh, uh, grid view it's displaying in the excel file and with the name is student file dot